Let's uh, talk about what uh, the president had to say yesterday. What, what struck you? What, what, did this strike you at all? Because in my mind, he was just uh, once again calling ISIS. Uh, I tweeted it out as he said it. He was back to calling them a JV team. Well, he was, Steve. And again, he downplays the threat that is posed. It's not just by ISIS, but it's posed by any element of radical Islam, a force that he can't seem to be, bring himself to be able to say. But I also thought it was very revealing when in his defense of Islam, which is uh, something he's given to do, he talked about how that the voices of criticism against Islam uh, were unfair because it might lead to attacks on mosques and Muslims. Well, here's two things that came to me. First of all, the biggest worry in America is not that somebody's going to attack a mosque. It's that people who come out of those mosques are going to attack Americans like they did in San Bernardino and in Boston and in Little Rock, and in Fort Hood, and that's what I think scares people. But the second thing, if the president would check his own FBI files, he would find that out of the 5,500 total hate crimes in the U.S., according to FBI statistics for last year, only 1,100 were religion-related, and of those, only 16% were directed toward Muslims. 